Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to create a nice border effect, border animation effect using only HTML and CSS. This is the effect. As you can see it's pretty cool. Let me zoom in. Okay, so this is what we're gonna be doing. If you are new here on this channel, I post uh, videos that will help you become a better web developer so that you can earn more money and improve the quality of your life. If that is something that you're interested in, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and also hit the bell notification icon so that you won't miss any of the new videos that I upload. With that being said, let's get started. I have an empty folder here on my desktop and I opened it with my text editor which in my case it's brackets. I'm gonna create the index.html file and the style.css. Now in the index.html I'm gonna make some space first. Now I'm gonna give it a basic structure, change the title to CSS border animation. I'm gonna link my style sheet, so link style.css. Inside the body I'm gonna put a div with a class of content and uh, an A element and I'm gonna say animation. Okay. This is it for the HTML. Let's open it in the browser. As you can see, it's right here. Let's uh, zoom in to the maximum so we can see it better. Now I'm going to go to the style.css. And in here, first I'm going to make some space. Now I'm going to select everything with the asterisk. So, and I'm also going to select the before and after. Uh, give it a margin of zero, padding zero and the box sizing property set it to border dash box <clears throat> body i'm gonna give it a background of uh, af4646 a font family arial sans serif let's see what it looks like okay now let's select the level the class of content so that content uh, position set it to absolute. We're gonna center it. Top 50%, left 50%. Transform, translate minus 50%, minus 50%. Okay, so now it's in the middle as you can see. Uh, now. I'm going to select uh, the link and I'm going to say the A elements, it's in only one. Uh, position, set it relative. Text decoration, none to remove the underline. A width of 170 pixels. A height of 50 pixels. Sorry, 50 pixels. A text align center, uh, line height, 50 pixels, uh, give it a display of inline block, a font size of 24 pixels, text transform, uppercase, and color white, FFF. Okay, this is it. Now I'm gonna go back to my text editor and use the pseudo selector before. I'm gonna say a a column before content. Leave it uh, blank between uh, sorry between single quotation marks. Uh, position absolute top minus two pixels, left minus two pixels width 0, height 0, background transparent, a border 2 pixels, solid, transparent. Okay, you can't see anything yet. I'm gonna say a column hover column before, animation let's say animate one second linear forwards 
now uh, I'm going to be using keyframes so I'm going to say at keyframes animate at 0% with 0 height 0 uh, border top color FFF I'm going to copy this three more times I'm going to change it to transparent 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 and change from uh, the first one is top border top the second right uh, bottom and left as you can see something is moving right here at 50% I'm gonna say I'm gonna copy this first two more times a hundred percent and fifty percent I'm gonna say with 100% height still at zero uh, this time border top color is still white but the right color is uh, white as well and uh, the rest is the same and at 100% the width is 100% the height is 100% and uh, both the top border top and the border right have uh, white colors okay now I'm gonna copy all of this up until the the A so from the before on and uh, I'm going to paste it and change this to column after and uh, it's pretty much uh, the same for this now I'm going to change this to animate 2 uh, I'm going to change this to after and now keyframe from keyframes for animate 2 at 0% uh, I'm gonna change this to transparent. Oh, sorry about that. And the second one to transparent, and the last two. Uh, sorry, just the last one for now. FFF. At 50%, I'm gonna change the width to zero, and height to 100%. Now I'm gonna change this to transparent. This one as well and the last two will be white sorry okay and for 100% the width and the height are 100% changes to transparent the second one as well and the last two are white and that should do it uh, one more thing I need to do is uh, go at uh, a column hover column after and say animation dash delay one second just so it doesn't start at the same time as you can see right here but has a little delay as you'll see right now as you can see this is the desired effect if you enjoyed this video make sure to go ahead and hit that like button comment down below tell me what you think uh, or if you have any questions uh, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you in the next video take care